I agree when people say that a lot of money is borrowed from China to pay for programs and services. Borrowing money the way they are is destroying this country, while the people are out of work. Sure this country is on the verge of collapse, thanks to the Federal Reserve. It was determined that once the Federal Reserve was created this country has been on the downward path ever since due to power and greed. Regarding the unemployed, I have seen many people struggling with the bare minimum and still are finding it hard to live. You may ask why is that? Well one example is jobs are a ratio of 6 to 1. People have applied for work with no success as either they require experience they pay peanuts, far less than, what their rent food and other bills call for and the latest one I have seen is that these employers won't hire if they are going to pay more in medical cost and taxes because of the greed. This Senator Jim Boning is well off he has nothing to worry about, but knowing well of these same issues that I mentioned decided to play hardball, he wanted to have the tax breaks reinstated for the wealthy, with no regard to those out of work and need help. He's only concerned for the wealthy. He deserves to be thrown out of office for this selfish and greed act of his. What's next I wonder, how much time will it take for those unemployed, to get back on their feet if we continue to go down this path. I thank those who supported the extension, however it's short term and we need a better long term solution of benefits while they look for and get a job. And speaking of jobs we need to have jobs that will pay more than the minimum wage, to offset the ever increasing cost to live, so we can rebuild America, and stop borrowing money from China. We need to be strong again and avoid becoming a third world country.